Unless you need. Yeah, I probably can. Alright, <coughs> guys, welcome back to a new video. So, it has been a long time since the channel started. And when I look back, when I look back, it's grown a lot. So, welcome back to another LEGO creation video. And this time, this time I think this is the most like insane build I've ever done. You guys may think it's like, I don't know what. See a spaceship? Maybe not. Maybe it's something else, like what? <laughs> so I'll just tell you how it started. I was just like uh, watching, I, I, I like Transformers and like Lego as well, so I thought, do you think there'll be something like connected? I thought it to myself, and then I just checked it on Lego Transformers and it was there. Then it struck me, why not I make my own Transformers? So here he is, Star Scavenger. Yes, Earl is also a Transformer, but Earl is not technically a Transformer since he's pieces break up a bit so I wouldn't really classify it as a transformer. Now the Star Scavenger has got a lot of detail on him, the coloring, the blue, what is it, like the wings. I like it how I like how I did it. Like I don't know what to say. I think it looks awesome overall with the cabin. Oh is this everything. The hands are showing up, which I don't think is a good idea, but for a beginner transformer, I think it'll work. So transform Star Scavenger. You strain the, what do you call it? I think I'll call them the land, landing gears. Straighten them out. Pull them out, pull these. Let's see. Pull this out. Align the red thingy together. Take the small cabinet in the back and turn it around and put it back. Now pull these around and straighten them up. Pull these down. Fold the others. See, sometimes the annoying thing about my Legos is they break up before you can even, you know, <coughs> start working on them. Now let's. And this. Now, the third is Star Scavenger doesn't have so much of articulation. Didn't have so much of articulation on him. He was honestly just like this before. Now, I imagine the Star Scavenger is cut into two parts. So, now this part is the part that how Star Scavenger is, and this part is how Star Scavenger was before. So, I'll give you a minute to stare it just without me. As you can see, Star Scavenger has a lot of articulation compared to now, compared to before. Because before, he only could just move it up and down like this. And the arms were actually, like, what do you call it, boosters in vehicle mode. Then I thought, why not just, you know, that's, that's just useless. So, I took out the arm and I placed it right there. Now, the instruction video for Star Scavenger will be coming out soon, I guess. <sighs> so, Star Scavenger has a few weapons. I don't know where I really kept them right now. Where is it? Is it right there? I don't know. I don't know where I kept them, so... Uh, I'll just show you the next video and the creation and everything I made. I just don't know where I kept it as well. <sighs> Alright. Now, if you guys want to see more LEGO Transformers, comment down below, Transformers, subscribe, and don't forget to like. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!